Hello everyone, my name is Captain Zombie, and welcome back to Dying Light. Yes, I know I am right now outside, I just left the safe tower, and I am about to find some shots of a cure. Well, not a cure, like, Sombra, pretty much. Um, Anti-Zen, I think is what it's called? I can't, I don't know if I said it right or not, but yeah. Yes, I'm in a different area, I just left the tower. Um, didn't go anywhere else. I just wanted to look around for a bit longer, have like my own video, my myself a little time just to look around for stuff without talking or anything like that. So now we are outside. He told me to go straight and make a left somewhere. Oh crap, there's one right there. Finally! Oh. <laughs> okay, there we go. I guess the little red thing right there represents the um, weapon's health, I guess. Probably. Maybe. I wonder you. Over there. Assassin's Creed on this bitch. I hope those rotting fuckers never figure out how to climb on top of a van. I'm sorry about that, I had a text for my pause saying about um, ships getting moved about snowstorm I'm having tonight. Doctor? Hello? Anybody there? Camden, are you there? Damn it. Uh, so, I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? No, no. Suppressant. It's called antizen. Suppresses the symptoms here. Sit. Antizen postpones the inevitable. Best the GRE could do. Inevitable? So, th there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. There's no cure right now. But you see, I've been running tests on both antizen and infected and tissue. Voices. A cure is possible. Definitely possible. Oh shit, you really think you can figure it out? With oh. Dr. Camden's help, yes. I think so. Uh, now, where did I put that injector? And who's Dr. Camden? A colleague trapped in Sector Zero. Where the outbreak first, well, broke out. We've been collaborating via radio, though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit, I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city, hoping some of the infected would eat them so I could observe and document the results. But they didn't? Uh, it bore no fruit. I'm ashamed that I wasted so much time on it. No reason to hold any antizen in reserve now. In any case... All right. I'm quite busy, so on your way now. What was I doing? Can 
sent most of right. his best people. Um, Raheem, Zara checked me out and gave me another shot. Okay, great. Not out to hold you for a while, which is good, because I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. So, time for a real trial. Go talk to Spike. You'll find him near Zeres' truck. He's got the first real job for you. Okay, so, yeah, the doctor in there, right in there. I know that voice from somewhere. He was the assassin trainer uh, on Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, Connor's is that um, Connor's trainer in Assassin's Creed 3. He's that um, trainer's voice. It took me a second to realize who it was. Yeah. All right, let's, go, let's take a look at our new quest. Hey, Spike. I'm Crane. <sighs> Just what I need. More unskilled labor. All right. Shut up and pay attention. There are two types of airdrops. One has food, first aid supplies, survival gear, and such. The other kind is filled with antizen. The GRE sends in a one-way video feed that lets us know when they're on the way. Look, the trouble is, the airdrops with Antizen keep getting raided by Ryze's thugs. And without Antizen, we're basically screwed. Ryze and his boys only operate during the day, because going out after dark is a dandy way to get killed. But the next two Antizen drops are coming down right at sunset tonight, and Brecken means to go after them. This may be our only chance to reach the airdrop. What's my part here? Well, as I said, going out at night is basically suicide. Or it would be if I hadn't been setting up safe zones and traps out there for weeks now, which I have. Now, Brecken and his team will be okay tonight so long as you get out there now and arm those traps. That's your part. All right. What are these traps and how do I arm them? You'll see. I'll be talking you through it. Just remember, without these traps, Brecken won't survive the night. And if he doesn't come back with Antizen, we are lost. Before you head out there, grab some firecrackers. Made them myself. They make a fine distraction if you get in trouble. Okay. Where are some firecrackers? What is that on the top on the top of my screen? Like level one or level one? I guess this is running or and fighting skills probably. Hey. Oh, there they are. Hey. Parry trap for Beckerman's mission. Okay. How far away is that? Okay. Search that body's chest, abandoned cars, pieces of furniture, and even trash bins to find crafting components. Weapons and money. Hold X or A. To use your survivor sense to identify objects you can loot. Searching an environment for huge locked chests left by other survivors. They're usually placed on rooftops beyond the reach of zombies and contain weapons or other valuable things. Ooh. <laughs> thought this way was blocked because I didn't check up there. Okay, first is the car. Open the hood, connect the battery, that'll arm the trap. Jade here. Is anyone outside right now? Urgent help needed. Uh, I'm outside, working for Spike. You're great, right? Listen, our runner's trying to secure one of our safe houses for Brecken's mission. He's in a courtyard by Vefa and Mimar, surrounded by zombies. We gotta help him. All right, I'm on it. Honestly, this game is pretty hard. <laughs> hard to like to fight zombies and shit. Like Dead Island, you were just—it was just easy to do glitches and shit, like finding weapons. Like have infinite weapons and shit like that. Infinite ammo for guns. What the hell? Yeah, but it's really hard. 
I would recommend for like some people who are like into this shit. The parkour is pretty great. It's like, I think it's like too much though. Are you dead? I wish you could, oh, you can kick. I was about to say, I wish you can kick in here. <laughs> um, was there like a crafting table I could use? this episode here if you like it please put this in your favorites or if you want to see more of my videos of dying light or other videos please click that subscribe button until next time i'm captain zombie signing off <laughs>